welcome to the Trinity's Church of Love. I am your pastor, Pastor Shakunda. And today we will continue our journey from Genesis 1. We will be starting on Genesis chapter 2. And when you refer to the Lord, our lesson is about Adam and Eve. And we will be starting from chapter 2, verses 1 through 22. Then we will review. So, um, if you could start with me to um, chapter 2 of Genesis. When you do, please say amen. Amen. And while you are doing that, please listen because I'm going to explain to you the who or what were and how and why they are there. Because some of my members here, they they don't know how to kind of exactly write notes exactly. So, but they don't, they, but they know how to answer questions like who, what, when, where, and how. So the questions are here for. So when you, if you write them down, you have like a base to start off with. And when you do, you have somewhere to go with your notes. Amen. So when you are there, please say, Amen. 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 Wait a minute, sister. Wait a minute, Pastor. I see your page is turning. Okay. Amen. And then it reads, because he blessed that day, and he rested from all his work which God created and made. Now in chapter 4, we're about to get into where he made Adam and Eve. And so it reads, these are the generations of the heavens and of the earth when they, are, when they were created. And the day that the Lord God made the earth and the heavens, and every plant of the field before it was in the earth, and every herb of the field before it grew. For the Lord God had not caused it to rain upon the earth, and there was not a man to the ground. So there was not one single human, not a single bone, not single flesh, nothing. It was just after God created it, it had waters and everything. There was no man to enjoy it. Mm. Say that, sister. There was no man to enjoy the goodness that God has made. Ooh, Jesus. No man. Mm. Then verses 21 reads, God created the great sea monsters and every living creature that moves, which the waters brought forth album abundantly according to their kinds, and every winged bird according to its kind. And God saw that it was good, suitable, admirable, and he proved it. God blessed them, saying, Be fruitful, multiply, and fill the waters in the sea, and let the fowl multiply in the earth. And there was evening and the morning on the fifth day. Amen. Amen. So, let me explain how... God made the very first, first man on the entire earth. So, verses 
so on the very the first man on the earth was named Adam. If you look at the board, if you look at the board, Adam. So God made Adam out of dirt. You know how you know we have dirt that we clean and roll around in like pigs. God made the very first male out of dirt. And so he named every living creature that there was and everything else, correct? Amen. Yes, he did. That's what he did. The Lord gave him the power. And the God, God said that he wanted someone to enjoy it with him. Oh, yes. But then God put Adam to sleep. Okay. <gasps> then, he, while he was asleep, he pulled out his rib and made a woman. Wow. Yeah. So now you see why we get the name Woe Man. Because the first woman was made out of a man. Hey, man. And then there was a woe because we bring horse. Wow. We bring okay. horse. Babies. Oh, she didn't broke that down. We bring forth and we we reap. We reap out of our bellies. We reproduce. We reproduce. We continue our life cycle. Yes. I said, oh, you learned that in that. I mean, it's, oh. We continue science. our life cycle. Life cycle. And so, after that, let me tell you just a little bit about the fall. So, when they were walking around, and so they were kind of particularly what we would like to call naked. <laughs> yeah, naked. So they didn't have nothing. <laughs> the woman's body was just out. What? Out. Mm, out. Nothing. So God said you can eat from any any tree in the Garden of Eden except the one in the midst. And so they followed the rules. They enjoyed their life until Eve went by the tree, and there was this snake. Mm. And the snake was very, very, very clever. And just to let you know, that snake was in the form of da 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 Satan. Mm. And he could talk like a normal human. And he said. Did God really say you could not eat out of this tree? And Eve said, well, yes. And then the sa Satan said, well, the only reason God doesn't want you to eat out of that tree is because you will be like him, knowing good from evil. And he kept going on, going on and on, convincing Eve. Mm. She fell for it. Oh, wow. And God said, you can't even touch the tree. She touched an apple because she saw it was good for food. She ate it and gave one for her husband. What? And he ate it. Obviously, he didn't know what tree it came from. <laughs> but guess what? What? After they ate it, mm. they realized they were naked. Wow. Mm. And then they sewed clothes. They sewed figs together and made them nice gal. I'm telling you, he is a very hairy. Wow. She know about the little strapless bra. To put on her dress. It was hot. But then, once they heard the voice of God coming in the garden, they hid themselves because they knew that they had sinned. And God said, Where art thy? Thou. And um, Adam said, We are hot behind the tree because we noticed that we had sinned, that we were naked. And then God said, Have thou is eating from the tree in the middle of the garden. And Adam said, yes, the woman you have placed with me mm. to guide me, mm. to help me. Mm. And Eve said, the serpent, the, the snake, tricked me. Mm. So she noticed herself, she got tricked. Mm -hmm. Mercy. Then God, he cursed the snake. And said he will go around on his belly 
Obviously, he put wall. <laughs> oh, Jesus! He was just going around on his belly mm -hmm. and eat dirt. Later on, God, he cursed them. They were forbidden out of the garden of Eden. Amen. And that was the fall of Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise the Lord, sister. Good job. Good thank job. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, can we close in prayer? Is anyone led to pray? Okay. Lord God, thank you for this day, Lord God. Thank, thank you, Lord. Thank you for bringing us together and thank you for opening everyone's understanding. Yes, Lord. Thank you yes, for the word. Thank you for keeping them, Lord God, on their way here. Thank you for keeping them on their way back. Yes, Lord. Yes. Bless us, Lord God, as we go to and fro, Lord God, from your house, O Lord. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 Bye. You have been a good member of Trinity's Church of